graffiti, as we know, is from uh, the state, US, and uh, actually it's illegal. Comparing with last time, now people is uh, more acceptable because people being exposed to internet and they have seen graffiti or maybe mural or street art, a good quality one. But yet there was still um, a lot of like real graffiti artists like they just try to put their name in different places without permission. So maybe this is perception towards uh, like people on graffiti. But then yet we, we, we have changed a lot already. Now they are more acceptable. I think minority of the people doesn't accept it for me now. I'm Kenji Chai. I'm a graffiti artist. I'm from uh, Sabah and I'm based in KL now. So basically, uh, after I have visited the uh, Bono Tree of Life was done by Chen Li, the photographer. It really inspired me a lot because I'm really, basically I'm from Borneo, Sabah and uh, I didn't discover much knowledge about um, the animal in the forest. It's a really mind-blowing kind of like exhibition. So I hope that everyone could come to GMBB to have a look. It's really inspiring. I have chosen um, some animal that been featured and try to implement it into the wall and using my style. So for my style, I could say it's like I'm more into like nature and um, animal. Like I want to portray like um, forest or jungle because we are living in this concrete jungle with a lot of stress. When my client approach me, I hope that I can bring like something more calm and more chill to be painted in their office. Let's say example like maybe uh, if you've got one client want me to paint like a skyline into their office, I might not get the job because like, I feel like this doesn't make sense. Whereby we are already in this city, what we want is like a, something different that really can give them a really relaxed feeling to make them feel like an uh, office is like their house, their home. I want to create a feeling of a uh, night scene. As you can see, there's like a door. To really merge the door with this mirror, right? I need to make it like a box that being glowing. Whereby when people open up the door, you can see it's like glowing up, like a magic box, whereby you can discover more content in GMBB. I just try to like place the animal in different way to see does it look balanced and, and, and looks good because like, some of the animal is quite small and to create the front and back um, depth, I need to really control nicely. Like maybe the lizard is at front, really, really front and try to not outlook the uh, bird because the bird is quite big, right? So we try to like make it like look as legit as it can, uh, more make sense uh, in that way. I think it's kind of fun like uh, to implement some uh, urban kind of like thing, match into it and also to keep the essential like spiritual. Because skull it doesn't really I want to change people's perception on looking on scowl like it's us but after death and then also to portray like uh, those um, people who live in the forest headhunters or maybe to also try to get some idea for them to really maybe study more or maybe look into it before all of the culture extinct so try to keep it on the, on the wall from these um, pieces I hope that people can really uh, pay attention to the forest and all those like Besides like being brainwashed by the uh, political or maybe marketing way. So I hope that they can get near or more to like the forest and try to appreciate more, preserve it. So the next, next generation still can enjoy what we have done today. Um, I still remember I was working in a company whereby there was too much of the um, guideline and also like what I want to do actually doesn't um, really show my creativity because like uh, let's say example like you do like a commercial like KFC you couldn't change the red color into like uh, blue or yellow so there was too much of the C CSI we need to follow the space for me to express just very small whereby I was like kind of boring with the computer work I think back to like um, 12 years ago maybe 
I was like um, asking my few friends whereby they teach me how to paint on the wall. So it really triggered me about um, why I really do art when I was a kid. It's because like I feel boring in class and I want to like draw in the textbook. I feel the moment is like uh, the happiness couldn't get anywhere else. It triggered me back to that feeling. So I always free my time on uh, the weekend and paint with friends, wherever I can really express what I really want to do. Even though we do the same thing, but in other countries, they might be, have different weather, different kind of people, they speak different language. It's a good way to learn how to adapt. And from the adaptation, I do find a lot of inspiration from different kind of people. They have um, full of the uh, culture that yet to be discovered. Chaigo is the, uh, the outer ego character that I have um, created back in 2013, whereby I was like driving along the highway and then I saw a lot of uh, stray dog being banged down. It triggered me because like no people care about it, even though it's a living thing. I decided to use it because I feel, I kind of feel like we are the same. Like when I was chasing my dream from KL, I mean like from Sabah, come to KL, and then I need to like find my shelter, find food, no matter how, how hard I need to like keep on um, surviving. But I do learn a lot to be independent and try not to ask from parents for what I want. I need to get it by my own hand. And there's no free lunch in this world. So from this chai go, I hope that can bring more positive energy to the people. As you can see, I painted on the street. As we know that social media thing, we have a lot of like um, theory. Every day we're learning new things. But the problem is that because we waste too much time on social media, right? It doesn't really help in uh, the practical side. Whereby practice is not really enough. There's like many people ask me that, uh, Kenji, I can't draw. Uh, I ask them how much have you tried two times. Of course, two times doesn't really bring out anything. Maybe you just focus on how you can manage to get what you really want to do. Then you count how many times you fail. The purpose is to enjoy the progress. So if you really like have passion in art, you have to like learn how to just give and keep on practicing until you make it.